Here's lunch today. I got these TV stands. First day, I have my on TikTok in three years. Good morning guys and welcome to another vlog. I'm Sydney, if you're new here, happy Sunday. I'm about to head out to go to church. So I um, just kind of got around. I originally planned on waking up a lot earlier than what I did, but uh, that is why we've got slicked back buns in our lives because we can get ready in record time. Uh, I'm going to church and we'll do, I did a really good Saturday reset, I would say, so I don't have a crazy amount that I need to get done today, but we do need to get groceries, need to do a little bit more laundry and stuff, so I figured I would just take y'all through a little Sunday in my life. Not the ninja creamy to go. <laughs> Here's my outfit. We're going to Publix, to Sam's Club, run a couple errands. I've got these Reeboks on, and then my Set Active dress, and Stanley Cup. I'm forever, Jay always makes fun of me because I always walk out of the house with 7,000 things. But the priority is always the camera. Normally I will forget my phone, but I will, I will always have my camera, always. Y'all are my priority. <laughs> Here's lunch today. I did some ground turkey. I did 93 ground turkey and some cauliflower rice. I got 93 ground turkey from Sam's Club and it's like a two pack of like a ton of it. And I um, have to use the heck out of it right now because I underestimated, overestimated how much I was actually gonna need. Some salsa, which I use the Thrive salsa that I get. I actually need to do my Thrive order today. I need to make a mental reminder on that, change what I'm getting. And then I have this little stir fry veggie thing with some snap peas, some broccoli. I cut up some mushrooms. We've got avocado in here. I'm trying to think what else. And then coconut aminos. Okay, I'm gonna make it a priority. This has makeup on it somehow. It's gonna go in the wash. I'm gonna make it a priority to kind of like tidy up every single day. We'll make sure that I'm sticking to that, actually. I was about to say, we'll see if I stick to that, but we're gonna make sure I do. And I just think that it makes me feel so much better mentally if I just stay up on it. And also, it's so much easier to do that way rather than wait for it to get unbearably horrible and then do it. So. We're gonna tidy some things up, put some stuff away, uh, make sure that my uh, closet is super clean for the new week. I do need to get more of these little clampy ones because that's what I put all my sports bras on and I ran out. So I don't think I even have enough for all of my sports bras right now. And I have my shorts on there too. <laughs> So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pile everything that I need to put away right here, or hang up, I should say. Because I've even realized, I think, one, the excitement of a new space and, like, also just feeling like there's so much to show and so much, like, creativity that can go into decorating a home and all of that, and, like, also just... I don't know, like being excited for just uh, life being different right now. And like, obviously I was very in a consistent routine. So like kind of finding my new routines here has been super exciting, but I will say that I think a big part of like feeling so good is being in a really solid like routine of having everything clean now that everything is put away and organized. and. Also, like feeling like I have enough space for things. 
I did get rid of a ton of stuff like between uh, my friend Sky took a bunch of like my clothes because we're the same size and we wear the same shoe size my sister always takes like a lot of clothes that I just because you know working in the space of social media you do like buy a lot more clothes or you get gifted things and like I hardly ever really get gifted clothes it doesn't really like happen that often like there are times here and there but also like I love linking stuff and like I like finding cute new clothes for you I like taking photos and clothes and showing you guys how outfits look and stuff so in the world of being an influencer there is a lot of consumption of clothing so luckily like I have a lot of people in my life that are all very similar size and like of course it's nice being able to let my sister have a lot of that because I grew up always wearing her stuff and like she always had the cute clothes and like she always had so much more stuff than what I did and I loved it and so now like it's kind of a good feeling that I'm able to almost not repay but like it's nice that we're able to share a lot of things and so and like I'm able to give her clothes that whether I've worn a lot of it or they might be like something I've had for a while and I haven't worn and yeah like I hardly ever sell on Poshmark or anything just because one it's like a full-time job I don't know how anyone sells on Poshmark but also like I have so many people around me that would like benefit from that my mom my sister like we're all the same size so and like a couple of my good friends so uh yeah let's do a little tidy cleanup situation i got these cute things for all of my sunglasses i think my sunglasses will fit in here oh yeah that's gonna be perfect oh i'm excited for that i like have i've kind of like lost a couple sunglasses throughout the move they've got to be some here somewhere around here as i just got done saying i'm so clean and organized <laughs> Okay, I feel like we've got some home updates to give y'all before I end off this vlog. So, I got these TV stands, also these slippers from Amazon. I got these TV stands from Amazon, and I actually ordered four of them, but I thought that they come as a set of two. They do come as a set of two, so I don't know where I went wrong, but regardless, we're gonna do another one right here and another one right there, so it's gonna almost take up the entire wall, and I think that's gonna look really, really nice once that's in here, but this can at least give you a feel for what it's gonna look like, and then obviously that will cover that cord. And we got a 75 inch uh, frame TV, so I'm still gonna look for some artwork, but then I also ordered a frame that should match almost I would say almost this color to go around it. So I'm looking for some artwork to go on there. Do you guys get yours off of Etsy when you have a frame TV? I'm like not a TV girly, but if I'm gonna have a TV, I like the frame TV because it does look like artwork. And then this is still the same olive tree that I've had. And then over here, we've got the same couch. Amazon rug finally came in. It's ginormous. And then through here, I'm about to do a little I'm about to relax for a little bit and then I'm gonna clean up some. But this is the set of four of the Amazon bar stools. They look fabulous. And then what else do we got going on over here? These were all up on like shelving, not the candle, but up on shelving in the apartment too. I'm gonna put away my air fryer and I feel like that's everything. I got a Decenio um, package in and so I've got some artwork I think that I'm going to use for the master, I think, or for my office. And then I also got in these, which I've shown you guys, the artwork, but I don't know if I'm gonna use these ones or get ones with a different frame right here because I don't think I'm gonna do the white frame like I originally thought. What else do we got going on over here? So we also have these that I just got in. Not anything to do with home stuff, but I needed some headphone jacks so that I could do a mic'd up workout. So I think that I'm gonna try and do that 
in the next couple days. I'm excited for that. But I think that I'm going to end off this vlog right here. I just wanted it to be a little, take you through my Sunday. Uh, I guess the Sunday routine had church and then came back here and just kind of did a little reset. We went to Sam's Club, we went to Publix, we did go on a little walk and it was really, really hot. So we were thinking that maybe we would go on a walk tonight. But this week, we've got some exciting things going on. My mom's coming on Tuesday, so that's going to be so fun to see her. And it's going to be her first time seeing the house. She didn't even see it during the building process. Like, she'd been to uh, Florida during that time, but we hadn't, we hadn't come over here just because, like, there wasn't a ton to see. And then, uh, what else we got going on this week? It's my brother-in-law's 30th birthday, so that's going to be exciting. We'll all do something for that. And... Yeah, just more home stuff that I'm excited for. Actually, this is going to be the first week that we're like settled in. So I think that it's going to be a week of figuring out what routines are like here and everything. And like just kind of actually feeling settled. Um, we had someone come build those two TV stands. But since there's going to be two more coming in, we'll have them do that. And then also finish off my desk in the office. Because Jay started it, but it is five million pieces. Like even the handy guy or the handyman that was here. He's also who mounted our TVs. He was like, this is a really, really confusing desk. Like I wouldn't even try and attempt it or else you're gonna drive yourself crazy. So like just leave everything where it's at. And when I come back to the TV stands, like we'll also knock out that. And I also have a chair that came in and yeah, that's honestly about it. Yeah, I think that's everything. So hope you guys enjoyed my Sunday in my life. And also just like, thank you guys so much because I've said it a couple times, but like y'all are the reason that I can even, honestly, like I'm just, I'm so grateful that I get to share my life with you guys and like the reason that I can live the life that I do and continue to do what I absolutely love is because you guys follow along and I love connecting with you guys. I love this corner of the internet. I'm so just, I don't know, living this, this dream that I could never in a million years, um, a couple years ago, even dream up or imagine or pray for but it is amazing so i'm thankful for y'all also looking at my grass because it needs to be mowed desperately this is this is living uh this is only a home now we've got lawn care that needs to be done <laughs> um, but i will see you guys in my next vlog you guys know by now that i typically will vlog unless you're new here typically vlog almost every day of my life so there's probably a couple days actually matter of fact <clears throat> why am i losing my voice TikTok. i Two days ago, I was the first day I haven't posted on TikTok in three years. In three years. That's crazy. Crazy. And someone commented and they were like, hey, like I've followed you for so long. Like I think that my TikTok's glitching because this is the first time I've seen you not post. And she was like being completely serious. I'm like, no, it really, I didn't even notice it. I think because I was posting so much on, or I'm posting so much on YouTube and I'm trying to do Instagram and like all the things. And how did it slip away from me that I didn't post on TikTok. <laughs> I must have really been like in the grind of everything else, but it's not even like I like intentionally, it's not like I'm like, oh, I didn't want to lose that streak. But at the same time, I like, that's so cool that I could go three years without missing a day of, of posting a TikTok. Sometimes they're just like random like outfit ones, but still um, pretty cool. Yeah, I clearly love what I do. Not gonna get burnt out of something that you, you thrive doing, I guess. Um, I'll see you guys in my next vlog. I love y'all. I adore y'all. And thanks so much for watching. Ah, my camera's far away. <laughs>